This was the day, the deciding day in the second semi-final of the Louis Vuitton Cup uh, for challengers. The first finalist was chosen yesterday, Ineos Britannia beating Alinghi. Today the second slot was up for grabs, American Magic who came from 4-0 down to be 4-3 by the start of the day had to win the first race to stay in the hunt. It made a good start, American Magic, and in the first two crosses on the first leg were in front of the Italians. But on the third, the Italian boat powered on by to a 20-second lead at the first mark. It maintained that advantage through to the second, 21 there. But then the Americans got some hope with a big wind shift, which closed them to eight seconds by the halfway mark. However, again, the wind went the Italians' way and they extended on the fourth leg. A big touchdown by American Magic uh, extended their deficit there um, to 51 seconds they were behind going into the last leg and one minute, one second behind at the finish. That's the end of the American dream for this America's Cup and it sets up a challenger final between Luna Rossa and Ineos Britannia. Again, a repeat of what we saw in Auckland in 2021. There's now a break through until Thursday of next week before we see these two teams in the final. Delight, of course, on the Italian boat, one of the crew thumping the side. Uh, the American Magic skipper Tom Slingsby congratulating his crew but regretting some of the decisions he made in that final race. That now leaves us with the two finalists from the Challenger Pack, one of whom will go through to meet Team New Zealand.